What I think makes Oregon special is the diversity in landscapes. And Northeast Oregon is one of those iconic landscapes that makes Oregon unique. These wild, wild rivers, these big, deep canyons. And I think that's really what's at stake when we make these decisions that have long-term environmental consequences. We run the risk of, of dramatically altering these landscapes with the removal of the 21-inch screens. The Forest Service is proposing to change the east side screens, which is currently a mandate, into a guideline. So a mandate is, is enforceable, and a guideline is an unenforceable suggestion. So they're essentially allowing the discretion of timber industry, other stakeholders, to determine what constitutes an old growth tree, eliminating really the only protection that we have for current old growth trees. We did this study where we were looking at all of the national forests on the east side of the Cascade Crest in Oregon, looking at the percentage of trees that were the largest and then how much of the carbon is stored in those largest trees. So we found that the largest 3% contained about 43% of the biomass carbon in the whole forest. That means that they're doing their job in keeping carbon out of the atmosphere. If you take away this 21-inch rule, you could stand to lose a significant amount of carbon out of those forests. There's actually some great big trees right here. Oh, yeah. This is what we're talking about when we're talking about protecting large trees. Large trees provide critical habitat for sensitive, threatened, and endangered species. They're also closely associated with biodiversity. And so when you're thinking about the ability of these forests to persist into the future, having that old growth component, that large tree component is critical. Last summer, my one-year-old daughter saw her first black bear in these forests. And she actually saw it long before the rest of us did and pointed at us pointed across the river and said, don't, 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 don't. She knew it was something big. She knew that this was a special sighting and watching her engage with wildlife in these places has been uh, a, a real pleasure to watch her grow. I'm worried that with this removal of protections for large trees that we're gonna lose some of the wildlife that live here, like those black bears. The decision I think reflects the pressure of timber industry and representatives, senators, elected officials that speak on behalf of the timber industry and don't represent the values of the majority of Oregonians like myself who believe these places should remain a place for wildlife habitat, a place for recreation. I don't want to see a Trump administration rule change carry on into a new administration and impact this forest for generations to come.